it's Lee and I am back today with another Dollar Tree haul for you. So full disclosure, while you're watching this Dollar Tree haul, I should be on vacation if all goes well. I wanted to make sure to have a haul up for you this week, so I did an extra trip around to some local stores and I have a haul for you. I also, as per usual, will have pictures of items that I didn't want but thought you might like to see. So make sure you hang around and check those out. If you're new here, I'd really appreciate it if you would hit that subscribe button and the little bell so that way you're notified every time I upload new videos. Subscribing is free and it really does help me out along with liking the video and leaving a comment. All right, so let me show you the things I bought. I picked up three of these Golden Farms Crispy Onions. My husband and son like to put these in soups and on salads and they just like them. And we've been out of them for a while and I keep forgetting to get them. So when I saw them this time, I grabbed three. I got one more of the Centrum Minis Men Immune Support. I gave my one son the other ones I bought and I'm going to give these to my other son so he can have some too. I got a little thing of downy. I'm going to pack this so that when I'm on vacation, if I need to wash some clothes quickly, I will have some fabric softener. I already have detergent pods upstairs, so I can just pack a few of those. Um, but yeah, I'm going to take that with me. Ideally, I won't be doing any laundry, but you never know. I picked up a 10 count of the nitrile gloves. Those are good. These are good for coloring your hair, cleaning the cat litter box, all sorts of things. And then I went ahead and picked up some reusable gloves for cleaning. These are heavy, du heavy duty gloves with textured palms. That was hard for me to say for some reason. Then by the register, I saw these Barbasol products. So this is Barbasol scissors and comb. I'm forever cutting my own bangs. I know they say you shouldn't do it, you should have someone cut your bangs, but most of the time I just do it myself. So I got one of those, and I usually just use the Dollar Tree scissors, and I don't have any trouble at all. Then they had the Barbasol Precision Nail Clipper Set. They look really nice. They're textured. They look nice and heavy duty. Oh, it says non-slip texture. And then they also had tweezers, slant and point, also with non-slip texture. I just got one of each. We really don't need a lot of this stuff, but it doesn't go bad. I can stick it upstairs. If somebody needs them, I got them covered, right? That's how I justify it for me. <laughs> I got another one of these five packs of reusable, reusable veggie bags. I opened a pack of these in my last haul. I will try to remember to link that in the eye in the sky, which should be right up there <laughs> so that you can find it easily. Um, but yeah, I went ahead and picked up another. I was interrupted. Anyway, I got, I was just saying that I got one more pack of the reusable veggie bags and those are from Natural Home. Then I found these reusable bags. So I found a lot of different types. I found the travel ones. We've got the just plain ones. We've got the ones that say, you go girl or something like that and some dinosaur ones. And now I found the small ones. How big are these? Two, a uh, set of two snack bags, seven by 4.6. They hold one and a half cups. So I picked up three of these. Um, these are Super nice to have on hand, and you don't go through as many Ziploc bags that way. So this next item is love or hate. People love it, or they hate it. I love it. Now, I don't know about this brand, but I love these. Candy corn. 100% American-made candy corn. So one thing I like, well, I don't like to film on the floor, but one thing I like to check is if they're soft, and these seem a little soft. Look, I squished this one. They're mine. It's okay. So I like that. I don't like the ones that are really hard to chew. I got um, six ounces of candy corn. And I got the Mellow Cream Pumpkins. I love these. And then I got the Autumn Mix because I love the chocolate ones too. 
I love all these so much and I'm, I'm hoping that this is all I'm buying for the year. I don't plan on buying any more. I'm gonna get my fix and be good, right? We'll see. Next up, I got this candy. They're calling it a candy bucket. It's a candy bag. It's shaped like a black cat. It's round on the bottom. And I got this because I'm going to be delivering some stuff to somebody's house. I know, I'm crazy. It's just I have a few things for a person and I like to put everything in a cute bag or some sort of reusable bag and Halloween is coming and I thought this was so cute. So I bought this to put the stuff in to hang on somebody's door. Can't say anything yet. Well, by the time you see this, they'll already know, but that's okay. I'm still not saying who it is, just in case. And just like I said in my last haul, let me scooch you down a little. Just like I said in my last haul, I'm a liar. I said I don't need any Halloween stuff, nothing. Well, Dollar Tree has some really cool stuff, but I did buy a few things and I'm gonna show you, show those to you now. First, I got these stickers because how could I not? Look at the stickers. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. And does it say 32 piece stickers? And they're the cutest things. So I had to get those. Look at that ghost cat. Vampire cat, bat cat. It, they're, they're just too cute. Aw, there's Frankenstein's monster as a dog, or dog as Frankenstein's monster. So cute. And then we go from cute to creepy. Look at that eyeball. I mean, how could I leave that there? It is so creepy. Oh, maybe he can replace my little sheep sometime. Actually, this one's not for me. So I got an eyeball, that eyeball. And then they had an eyeball with a blue eye. Okay, all right. And then because I have green eyes, I had to get the one that is a green eyeball, right? I had to, I had no choice. So maybe the green eyeball will be up there during Halloween. I know some people will get upset about it because everybody loves the little sheep. But I also like to switch things up every now and then. Um, I used to have my Buddha statue over there. He's moved down a bit on the windowsill. So yeah, we're probably gonna start switching things up when I get back from vacation. I mean, maybe, I don't know. Anyway, they also had these fake books. At first I thought they were boxes, but they are definitely just fake books. And this one is uh, Secrets of the Stars, Fortunes, Tarot, and Horoscopes. And they just, they're just fake books you can set around. And I thought that was really cool. So I got this one. I got Crystal Magic. And Mastering Malevolence. I think these are cute or cool for Halloween. So that's why I got them. All right, that's everything I got for Halloween. I didn't do too badly. And then I found something that I had seen somebody haul and for the life of me now, I can't remember who it was. I wish I could. It might've been Sherry from Twisted Gypsy, maybe. Anyway, they are the Care Us First Aid Kits. So what does this one say? I didn't even look. Focus on the good. I just got it because it was pinkish. So it says focus on the good and in it there are six, well there are 18 band-aids, two wound dressings and one paper tape. Now these tins cost a lot more than this at Target is where I've seen them. Now, it's a different brand, I think it's called Welly or something, but it's the same kind of deal, right? They cost a lot more there. So I got one of these and then I got two of this one, the blue one. Let's see, is it just plain? It's for me, I can just open it. Yeah, it's just a plain design. And it has the same things in it as the other ones. So I got two of those. Well, you don't need both of them up there. And then this one is so cute, it's tropical. Again, I'm just gonna have to open it. It won't slide. This is what it looks like, beach bumming, beach vibes, vacay mode. Oh, I'll take this one on vacation. I'll take this one with me. So this is probably with me right now. Um, anyway, I got those three designs. Those are the only designs they had. 
in the store I was in. Let me back you up to see if you can see better. All right, so that's everything I found this time around in my very quick trip to Dollar Tree so I could have a haul to put up while I'm on vacation. I will have some other videos up, hopefully, so I'd really appreciate it if you would watch those as well. They won't be Dollar Tree hauls, but, you know, they'll be videos. So now I have pictures of items I saw but didn't want or need but thought you might like to see, so check those out and meet me right back here. Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed those pictures and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the little bell so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. You can also find me over on Instagram and Facebook at Lee's Home 05. Thanks for watching. Bye.